Hello everyone, this is Chris Cook, and welcome to my very first podcast. Today I want to start it off with something I've been thinking about, and that is DSLR versus mirrorless cameras. We can go past all the obvious differences between size and lenses, but You know, with the way things are going now with new technology, mirrorless cameras have come a very, very long way. You know, back in the day when they first came out, I'd say, if you're going to be a photographer, go with a DSLR. And I still actually believe that a lot. And I would say that 90% of what I do, I would definitely do with the DSLR, whether it be studio work or you know, what have you, but it's that 10%, it's that 10% I've been thinking about of where I would use a mirrorless camera. Mainly the cell phone, that's kind of what I'm I'm getting to here. Now, I have a mirrorless camera, it's an Olympus, and it's actually pretty nice for like a travel camera, right? You don't want to carry around a DSLR, just this big, massive camera, so, you know, size, an obvious difference, but what I'm thinking about is the, the cell phone. Now, where would I use that? Street photography, right? So the, the idea that I have in my hand, something I've been thinking about, and y'all you know, feel free to comment, and I would love to hear your thoughts on this, is for a really, really well, um, well not, not well, but i say that's the wrong word, but like a, can, a good candid picture, right? Now, I've watched videos about how to do street photography and you know how to put your settings, how to go out there, how to do it, and I, I want to try all of them, right? It's Street photography is something that I really would like to get into. It's not something I'm particularly good at right now, but it's on, you know, practice, practice, practice. But I want to go out there with some different kind of experiments. I've gone out with the DSLR camera, but I haven't gone out there with, say, just the cell phone. And the, what I, my idea that I have is with a cell phone, it's a little less obvious than what people are doing, right? Because we're all tuned to see what, if someone's looking at as you, especially with a camera. Everyone kind of notices. So with the idea, if you want a candid image, you want something smaller, perhaps, or something like a cell phone. Now, not, that's not to say that it, it would, you know, people would be completely oblivious to someone taking a picture of them with a cell phone. Where we all are kind of adapted to notice these kind of things. But in an age where everyone has a cell phone and we all see people with their cell phone on their cell phone all the time, you might be able to get that, that image you're looking for. No, I don't know. This is just an experiment, but I do want to get out there and, uh, next week and we'll try this out and I will definitely let you guys know how it goes.